<laughs> Christina, they've asked us to record a short movie about the own keynotes, and we're both laughing here because we've just done this, and then I found I couldn't manage to edit it. So this is our second try. So your second <laughs> try in this question, Christina, what is an own keynote? Well, an own keynote, I'll try to keep it short this time, <laughs> is everything that a keynote is not. Uh, no, seriously, uh, an own keynote is just a... Uh, um, a different way to engage people in the conference, the entire uh, conference cohort uh, in a session that is uh, much more stimulating and, and kind of uh, tries to, to kind of uh, challenge the, the, the paradigm of the, of the expert and try to kind of engage people in conversation and in discussions. Uh, and, and that's what this conference is all about, is about creating informal spaces for people to discuss meaningful and serious uh, topics. Great, so now we know what an keynote is, let's give them a few examples, I suppose, because we've both been privileged enough to do an keynotes. Exactly, I almost forgot that. Uh, how was yours? You did the first one in, in, in Barcelona, oh, was it for didn't me, you? Christine? Oh, it was fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> I did the first own keynote in Barcelona and of course we do these in pairs and we get people who often haven't worked together and say you've got to do something together. So I was working with Alex Caruso from Canada and I didn't meet him to the day before, a long way away in Canada, but we did talk quite a lot on chat be on Skype beforehand. Um, what we did is we crowdsourced the whole thing. We put up a Google Doc and we said, what do you want us to do cover in an keynote? And we were very lucky. And I think 17 or 18 people actually contributed ideas. So we sort of messed around, edited a bit and produced a storyboard. And then we said, OK, you must have something to say about these things if you want us to talk about them. So give us your slides. And they did. And so we met together the evening before the keynote face-to-face -face this time in a hotel in Barcelona, sequenced the slides, and away we did. We, we made an entire un-keynote uh, out of uh, crowdsourced slides on ideas around PLEs. Uh, and I have to say, it's the first time I've ever done it, and not done it since, but I greatly enjoyed it. Yeah, now, it was great fun. <laughs> you did Southampton, if I remember rightly, which was the second uh, PLE conference, wasn't it? What yes. What did you do? Um, I, I did mine with uh, with Scott Wilson, and uh, we met uh, the old-fashioned way. We met in a pub, <laughs> and we prepared that the day before, uh, and we decided to go for, for a fishbowl. Uh, and so basically, instead of crowdsourcing uh, ideas uh, from from people that were genuinely interested in these uh, uh, topics, uh, we had a couple of triggers, and we invited people to actually uh, be part of the, of that uh, of that event uh, in a very active way and to contribute with discussions uh, on the spot. Uh, and it was a lot of fun, I must say. Uh, I felt that people were a little bit shy at the beginning because it was a totally different format. Uh, but um, as as the event progressed, uh, it was really engaging and really interesting. And I I really enjoyed not having uh, to do it on my own and have all of these people with different uh, uh, perspectives uh, on the topics that we were discussing. Um, and it was really fun. <laughs> yeah, and I guess that... Uh... One of the things is we, we, we try to invite people to do the own keynotes who we think will enjoy it themselves, but also I think we'll, we'll get into the spirit of how, uh, how the PLE conference handles this. And this year, we we're lucky enough, we've got Michael Keres from Duisburg Essen University, Rita Kopp, who lovingly calls herself Act Welsh Cloggy, <laughs> who's Associate Dean of Education in Yorkville University, Helen Keegan from Salford, who many of you will know, and Steve Warburton from the University of Surrey. So well, what are we hoping they're going to do then? I have no idea. They're not disclosing anything to us, so <laughs> I think it's going to be a Real fun, uh, really funny, uh, not funny, real fun, you cut that. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's going to be real fun and, and, uh, uh, and, and we're going to enjoy it. Uh, but, but so far, uh, I can't get anything out of them. I don't know if you, had, you were luckier than, no, than I was. <laughs> they're, certainly being they're certainly plotting things, but they're keeping it very quiet. So exactly. it looks like it's going to be in the best traditions of the PLE conference, intense, Involve in the audience and a lot of fun.
Exactly. And we look forward to seeing you there. <laughs> we will indeed. Bye, Chris. Bye-bye.